Hello from the Big South Network studio, I'm Mark Bryant. This is our 2018-2019 Big South Basketball Preview. Very happy to have with me the head coach of the Charleston Southern Buccaneers men's basketball, Barkley Radeball. Barkley, so good to see you here. Welcome. Your new studios are beautiful. I know you're proud of them. Thank you very much. Yeah, yeah. well done. Well, let's, let's jump right into the season ahead. Talk about your guys. What's the makeup of the team this year? and Where are the points coming from and who are the leaders on the floor? Well, we're really excited about our team. Last year in February, we were 8-2 and two, and we felt like we were the best team in the league and got a tough draw having to play Asheville in the tournament there and played really well. So we have a lot back. Uh, we got a lot of scoring back um, and we're still very young, but a lot of our young guys really performed last year. And, you know, it kind of starts with two guys for us, really Christian and Flandris, uh, both returning starters, both tremendous players. Uh, we feel like we can compete at the two and the three with anybody in our league, and, and both those guys are terrific, are great scorers, uh, tremendous defenders, but most importantly are terrific people and just fun to coach, want to win, want to compete, want to do things the right way, and uh, very thankful for both those guys. Now, most folks are familiar with what the conference makeup is, but uh, talk about non-conference first for a moment. What your schedule looks like, any particular stretch of opponents or trips that stand out. Well, it's just a really difficult non-conference schedule with what we have returning. We've had a lot of problems with scheduling, and I, I've learned in a long career that that's a good thing. The years where everybody wants to play you may be okay, <laughs> but, but uh, we had a tough time. Uh, our non-conference schedule is very competitive. Uh, we, we play Florida, we play Middle Tennessee, we play Clemson, we play North Florida twice. Uh, we play Marquette, South Carolina State, at Furman. So it's a little bit more difficult than I would have liked, but certainly will prepare us very well uh, for what is always a tough stretch of games in, in Big South uh, conference play. Well, let's, let's talk about that because there is obviously a familiarity with the with the uh, list of opponents, but even this year, that's 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 changed a little bit. There are new members in. There's there's new coaches in. Uh, what does the conference look like to you this year? Well, it's just wide open. Obviously, Radford uh, winning the league last year and winning the tournament last year is, and the number of players they have returning, and then a, a terrific coach and and Mike uh, are, are, are the favorites uh, going in, but last year they were picked fifth. Uh, so you never really know. Uh, our league is always wide open, uh, and we feel like we have just as good an opportunity to compete this year for a championship as anybody else with what we have coming back. We're very confident in, in who we are and what we are, and I feel very good about it, but the league has changed. Uh, one of the uh, really unique things for me is going to be the new head coach at UNC Asheville. We're going to miss Nick. I love Nick and we're, we're uh, happy to see him go to Middle Tennessee, but uh, Mike Morrell there at, at UNC Asheville was on our staff just a few years ago and is one of my closest friends and is a wonderful young coach, great hire for Asheville, uh, terrific uh, recruiter and will do a really good job. So those games are going to be uh, those games are going to be tough for, for me uh, anyway, just because I have my feelings for Mike and I've, I've just enjoyed watching him grow professionally and he certainly deserves the, the opportunity to be a Division I head coach. Excellent. Well, we look forward to seeing the Buccaneers this season and what you're going to do over at CSU. And uh, we thank you for watching part of our basketball preview for 2018-2019 in the Big South.